Action 10 Chief Meteorologist Sharon Ray with your Doppler 10 weather forecast. Well, good afternoon. I hope your Monday went well. It turned out to be another very hot and sticky day. We even had a couple of small showers move across the area earlier today. Right now it's just hot out there and we have a lot of sunshine too. It's 92 degrees right now in Corpus Christi. Alice up to 97, really feeling that heat across the area as the heat index, what it feels like is at 101 degrees at Ingleside uh, Naval Air Station at 105 as well as Alice. So that heat index uh, just over 100 today and we'll be pretty close there again tomorrow. Tomorrow. Winds though weren't too strong today. In fact, you can see the wind speeds here under 20 miles an hour across the entire area. So nice breeze, which is always helpful on these hot, sticky days to help cool us down just a little. So tonight's lows drop into the upper, well, mid to upper 70s across the area to near 80 right at the beaches tonight. There is a chance we'll have a shower or a thunderstorm tonight. They would be very spotty, but later tonight through tomorrow morning, we do have that chance we'll see a few of those. Here is the outline for tomorrow. We're looking at in the morning some widely scattered showers and thunderstorms. You may have a few of those to deal with on your way to work in the morning. And then in the afternoon, they're very spotty and mainly in our inland areas. But toward the evening and tomorrow night, those are going to increase and become numerous by Wednesday morning, some of those with heavy rain. So tomorrow they'll be very hit and miss, but they'll be out there and temperatures are going to heat up again. In fact, by noon, we're at 89 degrees. Those winds staying under 20 miles an hour and a day similar to today as we reach into those low 90s tomorrow. But again, we do have that chance of a shower or a thunderstorm as temperatures climb tomorrow, anywhere from 90 at the Naval Air Station, 89 Ingleside and Rockport, uh, Kingsville up to 95 and Corpus Christi, 92 degrees. I have a few things to mention about the beach forecast. First of all, it is going to be a, a very warm day at the beaches tomorrow. The water is up to 86, but I wanted you to notice we have a high rip current risk the next couple of days. The onshore flow is increasing and there could be some coastal flooding. You'll have to watch for that during high tides tomorrow morning south of Port Aransas. So watching also for the potential of a shower or a thunderstorm, especially Wednesday at the beaches as well, some with heavy rainfall. Today we did have a couple of little showers move through. You can see on the last six hours here, very hit and miss showers of did move through the area and now that's going to be the case again late tonight and tomorrow morning as this tropical wave lifts northward this moisture is going to move in you can see it on future track here let me take you hour by hour this is starting tomorrow morning here come those showers i talked about but later tomorrow and into wednesday you can see how they increase through wednesday morning some of these again i do they're very tropical in nature they'll have heavy rain with them and persist on and off into thursday morning once that wave pulls out of here Thursday afternoon, we're going to start drying out and heating up. So as far as rainfall amounts from this, we're looking at about one to two inches, locally some higher amounts though possible where those heavy pockets land. But overall, one to two inches of rain is possible. That's in the next three days, higher amounts up the coastline. And then once that moves out, as I mentioned, by Thursday afternoon, we start drying out. But look at this, we're talking dangerous heat and humidity. This is the heat index forecast as it later this week. We'll have to watch for that after Thursday. Here is your seven day forecast then and you can see we've got that rain on and off. The most likely day we'll see the rain is Wednesday. Some of that heavy and then that'll bring temperatures down a little for Wednesday, but it doesn't last long. Here comes the heat. Here comes the humidity all the way through the weekend as we'll have plenty of sunshine for later this week.